Welcome to Business News on Plus TV Africa. I am Edidion Iwang. Well, Nigeria's Minister of Industry, Trade and Investment, Mr. Okechukwe Nelema, says Nigeria has signed a memorandum of understanding with Shadong Rui International Fashion Industry, a Chinese firm for its first ever cotton value chain industry with worth two billion US dollars. Mr. Nelema said this in Abuja at a conference confirming that the MOU was signed with a Chinese firm. According to him, the investment will comprise aggregation of an offtake of cotton from farmers for ginning, spinning, weaving, and manufacturing. This is expected to aggregate at least 300 million meters of African print, which will meet 20% of West Africa's demand. He also added that President Xi Jinping promised to open China's market for agricultural products from Nigeria. Well, the Nigerian Communications Commission says it will strive to ensure an amicable resolution between the government and the MTN group as the two parties negotiate the $10 billion dispute. The Executive Vice Chairman and Chief Executive Officer of NCC, Professor Umar Danbata, made this pledge at the ITU Telecom Conference in Durban, South Africa. According to Bloomberg, MTN has continued to deny the allegations and, and promised to defend its position vigorously. Well, still, the Minister of Industry, Trade and Investment, Okechukwe Nelema, on Tuesday at a media party said the growth and employment program has been impl being implemented by the federal ministry and sponsored by the World Bank was currently undergoing reconstruction. The federal government had disposed a total of $12.2 million to 910 beneficiaries under the project. It is expected to focus on manufacturing and service sectors, specifically supporting information, communication technology, entertainment, and others. A petition by the Deputy Chairman of the House of Representatives Committee on Petroleum Resources, Mark Bila, had alleged that NLMA diverted $35 million out of the fund to an illegal small and medium enterprise fund.